I'll cover you. Right. Welcome back. Oh, this door was closed earlier. I think yeah, I think I thought that that uh, flame symbol was going to be like some time to catch the crook or something like that, that but no, it's the it's the lantern. Where did he go? Ooh, we're looking for we're look, looking for a secret room. We're looking for a secret room. We're looking for a uh no. Validate. Always give validation. They look like Celtic runes. Charles must have brought them back. Do you from really one of his think they can game in here? I don't see any way out. It looks like an old seaway map. It do. Interestingly enough, it's got the the, the Scylla. Um, as I fucking mispronounced it earlier. Skiller. Um, so dark water is there, and that's the route it took. So was he trying to determine where he f they found the the magnificent catch? That's another. I'm gonna guess that's another whaling sh vessel, the Orpheus. The Progidal is probably a merchantman, considering that it goes from. Um, from you know near Boston to wherever that is is that that's not no I don't know what that is but up there is Madeira and uh, Spain uh, well Portugal probably and uh, same goes for the, the for the Saint Claudine which also looks to be maybe that's just like the the favorable current to be honest um, but yeah, which seems to go to, what's that? Plymouth? No fucking idea. But anyway, and, and yeah, like, well, the Scylla we know is a, is a whaling ship and, you know, comparing and contrasting the two, um... I think it's it's a fair shout to say that the office is is as well is as well. Ah, clearly Charles Hawkins knew Captain Fitzroy very well. Okay, so that's Charlie. That's Fitzroy. Who the fuck's that? I wonder who the man with the glasses is in the photograph. Probably another friend of Hawk. Why are these letters here? And not with Sarah Hawkins' belongings? Hmm. Letters from Sarah's father. Suspicious and more suspicious, unfortunately. This globe seems to have been part of some mechanism. Looks like it worked. Well done, Pierce. I was absolutely guessing that it needed to be on that fucking compass rose. I was, I was honestly thinking that it, it looks like a freehand map of dark water. Certain areas have been highlighted. I wonder why. Hmm. I, I was honestly thinking that it probably needed something. Basilla. It's the boat that was stranded at the entrance to the harbor. Um, something to do with the coordinates here. I'm, I'm super glad it wasn't because um, this doesn't have enough of a definition to, to be able to do that. But, I mean, you know, might have easily been.
tunnels under the Hawkins mansion. I wonder if these are bootlegging tunnels. Oh my, what if Charles's family, like way back, has been part of like some kind of bootlegging scandal? Secret passage, under the manor. It's like a detective novel. That guy must have already gotten far. Yeah, and he had a direct means of entry to the crime scene. We must find him. Three seats. Uh, I'm, I'm going to take back what I said about Silas, Look, knowing more than, than he was letting on as well, because... Did Charles Hawkins use this place? Um, having, having Who this... Who were the others? Having this place, um, or this passage, clearly... Whatever Charles means, Hawkins hid here, he didn't want it in his house. Means that Silas doesn't need to be involved at all. What is this mask supposed to represent? I was like, oh, it's it's just you know, the 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 Madonna with the the, the Jesus little baby Jesus, but no, it's fucking Cthulhu, Lady Cthulhu. Still stuff to be found, or reconstructed, rather. Hmm. Oh, there we are. This piece of cloth is unmistakably from a dress. Sarah Hawkins. Was she hiding from someone? So I think they were having an occult meeting. Sarah came and kind of, you know, eavesdropped because there was, you know, worries. Someone here noticed. Charles confronted her. I think this man might have noticed. Whoever was sitting here could have seen Sarah Hawkins. Could this be related to her death? See, I'm like a proper detective or more. This symbol. What does it mean? Hmm. Only one CP needed. Or you hope my sanity isn't waning too much. It'd be a terrible shame. Maybe she saw the, the occult meeting. He was going to make the family consume the flesh and like in, in like bring them into the cult by force. And, and she was like... Husband, no! And, and the, the, the son was like, Papa! Papa! Please, no, it looks like tentacles. Of course. There's tunnels all over this island. Given the size of this cave, there's got to be other entrances. You know, I hate Passage to say this. continues further down. Might as well start with that. But this is looking very much like where we're I ain't we gonna squeeze in there. I'll find another way. If possible, I prefer not to ruin my uniform. Fine, fine. Go look for another entrance. I'll try my luck down below. Yes, yeah, why not fucking split up? What bad has ever happened from splitting up? Well, let me fucking tell you. Everything bad.
I'm just surprised nothing grabbed my leg, but I suppose that's Some one of those of things. kind of dream catcher. If I touch it, it'll turn to dust. Bonk. Some kind of dream catcher. If I touch it, it'll turn to dust. I think this is one of those things where they kind of... I mean, making a game in the Cthulhu mythos... I mean, you're, you're already attracting people who are fairly... Well, at least fairly... Uh, well versed in the in the source material so you can play with their expectations as well which is actually like one of the things that it's always interesting when when I'm you kind of diary. subvert expectations the whole tribe seemingly disappeared in a mass sacrifice to the glory of their deity well, that's not good sad way to go well, yeah, I mean... These paintings must be several centuries old. I mean, the paintings are all well and good, but look at the fucking craftsmanship on that bad boy. No one locking it from that side either. Damn. Now, would it be prudent to slap a point somewhere? Yeah, I'm gonna slap one in there. Gives me a nice 50 50 for checks. Um, although the time has weakened these structures, I'm sure it has. Um, the the thing with um, like checks like that where it has an actual test against, um, I would I would like to see it do the test against visibly in in the same way as, for example, it does on um, renowned explorers or um, on the um, on the mobile um, chronicles of Cthulhu, where you've got a little roulette wheel kind of situation. Um, incidentally, Chronicles of Cthulhu, very good. Um, also free to play. Um, you get th three free stories um, a day. Or like three, yeah, I mean, yeah. You get to do three of the stories, whichever ones you wish, free every day. Or like, you know, three goes of one story. or However we wish you fucking put it. I don't have time to search them all. Um, which is which is pretty good. I mean, a anything further than that, anything involving money, it just seems it ludicrously. It looks like animal oil. It's certainly not whale. Ludicrously, uh, fucking out there in price. What the fuck is this shit? Is this Cthulhu oil? It's whistling. Yeah, that's not creepy at all. That's definitely not some sort of weird ritual of death. What's going on here? Piers! Keep your voice down. We're not alone. Good God. What have you got me into? We'll see. I'll go on. Try to go down on your side. Okay, yeah, so this is the place we started off. So, so Bradley is the faceless police officer we saw at the beginning.
Yeah, I heard of Fatong. That means yeah, this is this is this is full on Cthulhu shit. No thank ya. I got it. Okay. I can't breathe. What's happening? No, damn it. I must find a way out of here. So this is how we ended up in this this situation in the first place. Like in the dream. Is it, I mean, this is is it my turn? Yes. It is time. You will soon be one of us if your body and mind are ready. I dream of it every night. I have constant visions. I am ready. Good enough. Prove it to us. What the shit is going on? It's like in my dream. But yeah, I mean, it is like like in the dream, but I mean, this is getting it seems to have been used recently. Probably some sort of ritual. I mean, this is going like in a direction, in a in a in a place. I mean, how? Oh. I can't read Latin. How much further does the story continue? I mean, the 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 way it was set out, I I assumed. That it was going to be just dark water, but for that, like the story has been moving quite rapidly. Grant him your flesh and accept his, so that his body and yours may be one. Yibithnk, Hupadk, Kutulu, Bithnkor. Grant him your mind and accept his, so that his mind and yours may be one. Is he going to turn into one of those tentacle people? Grant him your dreams and accept his, so that the paths of your souls finally intertwine. Your El Cthulhu Kashag. Let his soul guide you to us, just as your dreams guided it to you. Your El Cthulhu Bogshuk. Let your dreamers open the way, so that the day finally comes when you will awaken. La La Cthulhu Nafal Fatag.
is that it? Okay, I, I was watching that with the 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 expectation that something was going to happen, but. Eh. Apparently you can't fucking trust cultists when it comes to this kind of shit. All fucking sizzle, no steak. Locked. I mean, that's the thing, no matter how good your sizzle, sooner or later you are going to have to provide the sausage. Or the steak or the bacon. Oh wow, those look like tombs. I'm low key glad that it's locked. Did I? Uh, no. I, I thought I, for a moment there, I thought I got myself stuck. But no. Is this really just nothing? Just a dead end? Yeah, that's a bit naff. I mean, I can't fucking. Surely I can't just. Mindest not thou me. I'm just gonna, gonna, like, you know. I. I feel him. You are gifted indeed. Not another word. Let him pass through every part of you. All okay, yeah. You who sleep, we pray for your return into the kingdom of the earth. The killer whales on here. Bring me more sacred flesh. The little differences. Actually make it far more unsettling than it, if it was exactly like the dream. Okay, so what the fuck is up with those guys? I mean, I, I assume they're currently dreaming. They're doing a, doing a snooze. Can I walk up to them? What happens if I go and... Booga booga booga! Can I... I can! Again, this primitive writing. Dead? This ritual killed him. Where's the sense in that? We are ready for the ceremony. What about your protege? His awakening is complete. He will join you shortly. Okay. It's gonna... Mm, don't mind me. It's fucking Charles, isn't it? 
I won't hesitate. Bradley, get back. Show. Get back. You asked for it. Get out of here. I fucking knew that cunt survived. What a bastard. Fucking Indiana Jones and Temple of Doom here. I fucking knew it was Charles. I feel bad for Bradley. Ah, ah, my leg. Ah. I mean, the way the story is going, it might actually all be on Dark Water, but it, it's still going to be like pretty substantial, which is is kind of what I assumed from the from the get go. So, not disappointed in the. In the slightest. Jeez. Light! At last. I really do feel a little bit bad about Bradley. Uh, chapter 5 Riverside Institute. Well, this is a fucking loading screen and a half. Oh, the man with the glasses must have been Dr. Fuller. No! They're all in on it. All the big shots, He's a of course. He will survive. A strong exception. There, he's opening his eyes. He saved him, Fuller. I, I can't get off. Don't move, Pierce. You can certainly say that you gave us a scare. What did you do to me? Undo these straps! Whoa, go easy, my friend. Oh, Dad, he killed you. Are you sure he's better? He was, he was dead. Me too, we, we were dead. What are you doing? I'm sorry, my friend. What? No! This is very Metal Gear Solid. Five. Random stain, yeah? What happened to me? Where am I? It uh, seems to be a padded room, and uh, it, has, it has been that magical half hour. So, uh, 
on that mysterious note, I'll, I'll leave you until the next time. I mean, what the fuck is going on? Bradley's dead. But Bradley's not dead? Toodles. <laughs>